Hello, today we'll be looking at increased magnitude 5 activity in the West Pacific and a odd earthquake in the Gulf of Mexico. In the past 24 hours, the West Pacific has seen a slight uptick in magnitude 5 plus activity. Just a few hours ago, there was a magnitude 5.7 near Taiwan. And then about an hour or so before that earthquake near Tonga, there was a magnitude 5.5. And yesterday at 22.58, there was another magnitude 5.5 near Fiji. Papua New Guinea saw a magnitude 5.4 yesterday at 21.10. Coming to this magnitude 5.7 near Taiwan, it struck off coast and it has a felt intensity of 6. Coming over to the felt reports from the USGS, there is 16. The EMSC has another 9 felt reports. Here is a station in northern Taiwan. We can see the signature of that earthquake. Another station in Taiwan. Near Ridgecrest yesterday at 2148, there was a magnitude 3. And then today at 10, there was a magnitude 2.9. Today at 11, there was also a magnitude 3 near White City in New Mexico. That area, of course, mostly oil and gas operations. Here's a portion of the map I have highlighted here. In that area I highlighted, I pulled up magnitude 0 plus earthquakes from 2000, and in this area we can see there has been an earthquake that is not near any other earthquakes since that time. This is a magnitude 4.5 in the Gulf of Mexico. This was at 7 a.m. today. So I was able to pull up some seismograms for this earthquake on the HH1 channel and it has a kind of a weird signature. Today at 557 there was a magnitude 4.1 just south of Juneau, Alaska. It was also close to Met Lac Atla, Alaska. Coming into the satellite view on the USGS earthquake map, it does look like it struck out in the middle of nowhere, on land. The felt reports are near Ketchikan and Prince Rupert. Alright, so I was able to pull up a few seismometers on the BHZ channel in the area. Here's a signature on one of them. Now this signature is weird on this station because it's the BHZ channel, but for some reason that looks like a slower sampling rate. Today at 1600 UTC, or just a few hours ago, there was a magnitude 3.7 near Coho, Alaska, or also close to Anchorage, Alaska. This earthquake did have 8 felt reports. These felt reports being near Anchor Point and then near Homer Airport or whatever city that is, Diamond Ridge. Coming over to Tropical Storm Julia, it did briefly head back out into the ocean before making landfall in El Salvador. It is currently in Guatemala. Coming over to the NHC, Tropical Storm Julia is the only storm listed in the Eastern Pacific. NHC is currently watching this storm just south of the Gulf of Mexico. They state a trough of low pressure over the Yucatan Peninsula is producing disorganizing showers and a few thunderstorms. They also note this system has a less than 40% chance of developing into a cyclone. Thank you for checking out today's video and stay tuned for the next one.